Hello. Henotheism is devotion to one god while believing in the existence of many gods. Some electromagnetic fields are alive and classify as gods, as referenced in the book of Genesis. So it seems that God is a mathematically psychological living electrical field, which has a 12 over 13 error. Fields containing errors must be rejuvenated continually or will, they will fade out at the math error leak point. 12 over 13, where 12 is progression and intentional perception, and 13 is intentional social association and intentional change, 12 over 13 produces jealousy and limits voluntary associations and individual changes. These are characteristics of the Old Testament God. He likely fed or feeds on the jealousy of other races or people towards the Jews and also on their worship of him. Also characteristic of the potential goals of many OT stories. Satan is likely a math psych living EM field which has an 11 over 12 error. X over 1 plus X and X plus 1 over X plus 2 field pairs often form in symbiotic deviant relationships, feeding and controlling one another slightly, with the upper number having a dominant role and the under having a submitting role. I. Satan's 11 over 12 where 11 is intentional association, amperage, and conformity, and 12 is de as described above, would be an overbearing, domineering, and lawyerly power sponge who attempts to prevent advancement and intentional experiences. This also coincides with Garden of Eden and Old Testament uh, experience. Both of these conditions are errors that leak and need to be endlessly reaffirmed by successful energy robbery or slavery of semi-sustainable, semi-intelligent creatures, such as humans. This is likely why God chose to create mankind in a separate solar system for more advanced creatures that reject his jealousy so they could worship him above all others, feeding his jealousy. God pairs with Satan in this case because Satan does the same thing and in return get some control over progression by a more powerful creature. Fuck you, Yahweh. Fuck you, Satan. Neither of you are good. Neither of you are sustainable fields. Your errors are the bane of mankind, the race you illegitimately created and lord over. Gray aliens, 17 over 18, and their evil pair, 16 over 17, are as disgusting. Mankind needs to move beyond these kinds of fields towards our next greatest leak level personally, and master that also. Right association, progression, and voluntary intentional society are mankind's major projects, and we will succeed in attaining them and crushing Satan and Yahweh's short-circuited power systems. Scientists have recently discovered that certain EM fields are alive. The events of revelations are upon us now, but they do not necessarily need to happen. They were revealed by a God who is both fallible and finite as shown in the mathematical EM field errors inherent in his personality. Good can occur without evil if you believe in infinity. Jesus Christ is a fine being. He is beyond God and Satan, and I hope that he returns soon. Thank you for your interest. Please forward this to the leaders of every faith and to MIT. Now, in the meantime, I am off to ride my motorcycle to Mexico.